Zambia Flying Labs is the pioneer of drone technology innovation in Zambia and we are actually a hub that is situated in Lusaka right now and we are looking to brand and grow ourselves in Zambia as a whole. We are affiliated to an international organization, a number of flying labs around and across the world. The, the drone technology has become one of the main features of running business in the world. Uh, here in Zambia we have the taxation company also uses it uh, in monitoring the trucks movement and all the borders. We can use the, the drones uh, spraying of larger farms and that has already been taking place for some time and so we needed to establish an institution that would train people in drones but would also facilitate uh, robotics and new technology and integrate it within the framework of national development. So one of our core activities is to make sure that we build an ecosystem that is centered around drone technology and oftentimes other robotic solutions. The way we are structured is in such a way that we try to identify a need in the community and apply smart technology to solve that problem. And one of the key examples of it is the recent project for Chunga Dump Site, which is a, a classic example of a major challenge in waste management in Zambia. And with that, we came up with a solution of uh, using drones to monitor stockpiles. With that project in particular, we're trying to ascertain or extrapolate by how much the dump site will grow using the drone data that we obtained. So we did this for Lusaka City Council, and there were other stakeholders involved. And by that, we helped them uh, come up with insightful information on how they should better manage the dump site. We had uh, a drone technology for the blinds and for the deaf. And we already scheduled to have other developments in the training uh, like boot camps. Uh, and that is specifically targeting the STEM. Uh, well, now it's called the STEAM because the arts have come on board. So instead of just concentrating on science, technology, engineering, but we now have science, technology, engineering, and arts uh, in the use of drone and other technology. We also do public demonstrations of what drones can do. And the goal for this is for us as a country to stimulate interest in people becoming more aware about some of these technologies uh, because uh, the whole idea of this framework is uh, the power of local. The uh, only way we can utilize uh, this opportunity is for us to bring it to the community so that uh, we can shape uh, local policies to favor more of usage of these kinds of technology as necessary tools to promote efficiency in certain uh, sector industries. As Zambia Flying Labs, our passion and drive is to promote um, a positive impact to accelerate STEM education. So as a Flying Labs, our future is actually to reinvent STEM education with drones. So our focus right now is we are looking at how we can engage the youths that are underprivileged, especially those that are disabled, those that have not even had an opportunity to go to universities and schools. And having done that, actually, we had a project which was actually a trial project at Munali, and we're looking at how we can do some projects like that in schools, communities, engaging these kids, engaging the underprivileged, trying to stimulate them in STEM education. Another focus that we're looking at as the Flying Labs is looking at how we can actually reinvent STEM education for the females, which we are calling She STEM. And in she STEM, we're going to have inclusiveness of females of different ages, from different groups, from different cultures, in promoting them to be involved in drones, involved in drone education, involved in stimulating them to have interests in science and technology, including also now arts, and which we are branding also under STEAM. As Zambia Flying Labs, because our agenda is focused as a hub, we're actually calling for the support from donors, institutions and organizations which have an agenda in promoting STEM education, technology and innovation. And because of that, we are looking at partners that are from all spaces and fields throughout the country and even outside the country. You can actually visit our website at flyinglab.org Zambia and you'll be able to see all the activities that we've been up to. 
And to reach us, you can contact us by email at zambia at flyinglabs.org.